Hey everybody, welcome back to the Runaway Guys Throne Controllers. Booyah! It has been three years since we have done this. Feels so, like 3,000. And if I look frazzled, it's because those three years finally caught up to me in one weekend. <laughs> I... I would like for I'd like for us to hear it for Proton John, who stayed up into the early hours of the morning getting this ready. Nope. I'm leaving. Bye. Five. Five. No, here's the thing. So here's the thing. So this is a new version of Throne Controllers. If it looks a little different, that's why. And that's because I need to give a special shout out to Wishmakers, who is in the audience today, because Wish actually built this current version. <laughs> Wish actually brought a laptop to help me uh, test this up to, and we were doing work like what, like 6 p.m. yesterday we got this? Yeah. And then I was able to put the questions in. So, uh, yeah, so it's gonna look a little, a little shaky, but like we got it working. <laughs> but you know what, if, it, if something breaks today, that's just really the throne controller's experience at this point, isn't it? Yeah. All right, so let's explain how this works. First and foremost, when you guys came in, you were probably given a card, right? That's a lot of cards. All right, Ooh. I've been told there's what, 454? 453. 453 cards in there. So what we're gonna do is we're going to be randomizing a list and calling you up to play Throne Controllers. You're gonna walk up to the microphone here in the middle and then you're gonna play our lovely game show. You're gonna have to answer trivia questions, play game challenges, and uh, or just uh, enjoy getting zero points on the scoreboard. <laughs> However, no matter what, even if you play, and especially if you get points, you do get to have... Oh, my cue. Okay. I would like you to draw your attention over to the 8-Bit Drummer and Family Jewels, who will be giving out your prizes today! We have many prizes for you coming up, and I'm here to offer you all of the fabulous ones. No unfabulous ones here. Courtesy of Fangamer, merchandise inspired by the best video games of all time, and they also have a place in the merch hall and that you can get the stuff that you see here at Fangamer.com. For just for participating, you can get an art card or a sticker sheet inspired by games such as Undertale, Deltarune. For getting one point on the board, you will get pins inspired by games such as Omori and One Shot. For getting two points on the board, we have various keychains, including 8-bit controllers, a Chrono Trigger, and all sorts of others. At three points, it starts getting real exciting. You get a poster. At four points, you get a voucher for any shirt of your choosing. Do not oh, take off your shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Come this on, is like, not a concert yet. <laughs> Give it time. Not any shirt. You can't have mine. <laughs> yes, I That's can. I think I get 10 points. Only Emil can have that. <laughs> At five points, you can get mugs inspired by games like Undertale and Celeste. <laughs> and beyond that, we need to talk. So... At the end of every show, we have something really nice for the top winner of the day. But this is our first show in three years. And so we you're getting nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, we all went broke. Um, but have you seen this gun? So today, we have something really, really, really nice. The top winner of today's show is getting two prizes with a combined value of over $500. <laughs> For being the top winner in today's show, you will receive an inbox Mega Yarn Yoshi Amiibo. It was upside down! <laughs> and a complete inbox copy of Pokemon Heart Gold. <laughs> So I 
would highly recommend having a number that is about to get chosen. We are going to be calling up four contestants to get us going here on this very special Throne Controllers. The first number being called up is number 105. Come on down to the microphone. Number 39039, come on down. Number, the most educational member of them all in this pool, one, two, three. <laughs> and oh number God. 26, come on down. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Really, Nick? Come on, dude. <laughs> You are the first four contestants, and now I'll hand it over to your host, Proton John. If you're wondering why I'm berating one of the members of the contestants' row, it's because he is the world record holder for Throne Controllers currently. Oh. oh, really? Really? I just thought it was because you're an asshole. Well, I am an asshole too, but that's besides the point. Okay. Just this once. Jeez. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good, how are you? Talk right into the microphone, because the mask can make it a little tricky here. How's it going? Pretty good, how are you? Not too bad. Uh, I'm gonna ask you something special here because uh, this is the first time we've done this. What's your name? Uh, uh, I usually go by generic. Generic? Yeah. Like that? What? Yep. Where's cool. That? You're all gonna learn how bad I am at A, hearing names and B, spelling them. So this is gonna be fantastic. All good. But the cool thing is now your name's actually on the scoreboard here now and uh, Fancy! We actually have a leaderboard this time around, too, that we can show off at the end, provided I don't break anything. Hell yeah, dude. Wish will attest to this. I Can't broke the leaderboard a number of times. I am sorry. All right, so here's how it works. You got uh, one through ten here. You can pick through on our lovely carousel of controllers. Woo! Uh, each one corresponds to a different category. It might be a game challenge, it might be name that tune, it might be something worse, something better. So uh, pick a number, let's see where we go. Number eight, please. Sorry, what? Number eight. I knew the first contestant of the day was gonna pick this, and I just had dread because it is the Devil's Deal. Oh! It's gonna be this kind of show, folks! <laughs> Hang on. Three years later, it's still the same. So this is why we weren't rated for the 12 and under group at MAGFest, right? Is this why? Yes. Okay. Something's never changed. All right, since it's the first time showing up, this but is the devil's do. deal. Big points, but bigger risks. All panels from here on out are now worth two points instead of one. However, you do remove any easy or multiple choice questions on the board, and every panel from here on out has a chance of being a brutal question instead. Do you take the deal? When in Rome. When in Rome. So when in Rome, sell your soul? I think I missed that part of history. All right. <laughs> Starting off with a devil deal. We've now given you a brand new board. Everything shuffled around, but you didn't know what was there in the first place, so no one cares. Pick a new number. Uh, number seven. Seven. Seven is a lightning round. Ooh! All right. So I'm going to ask you five lightning questions. You have to get three correct. They're all yes or no questions, basically. Um, you have to get three correct in 30 seconds. And your category for the lightning round this time around is, did they make that? Are these games made by Valve? Uh. Ready? You just need to get three correct. Let's do it. First off, Half-Life Alex, did they make it? Yes. Correct. Portal, did they make it? Yes. Correct. Dota 1, did they make it? No. Correct. That was a Warcraft 3 mod. Left 4 Dead, did they make it? Yes. Piece of cake, piece of cake. Aperture desk job, did they make it? No. They actually did make that one. That is actually for the Steam Deck. Woo! <laughs> All right, good start. Two points already. Where do you want to go from here? Uh, number four, please. Number four? Who the heck is that? I'm going to give you a silhouette and description of a character. Tell me who this is. He was the announcer in Bit Trip Runner 2, became a playable character in 3, and he even holds the world record for the character who has appeared in the most video games releases, but not as himself. Wow. <laughs> I have no idea. 
give me any guess. Take the hints that are there, especially that last one, and see what you can come up with. Uh, Meat Boy. I don't know. What? Meat Boy? Yeah, sure. You're, you've definitely heard of this person. Uh, it's a voice actor named Charles Martinet. <laughs> he is actually a playable character in Bit Trip Runner 3. Never in my life. <laughs> All right. Uh, thank you for playing, though. You have got the high score currently. Grab some prizes, and you can chill in the chair if you want here. Come on up. And our second contestant for the day is... Uh, I'm called Sergeant Dr. Funk. Sergeant, Sergeant Dr. Yo, Dr. Funk, Funk, how's it going, dude? Yeah, yeah. Going hey, right. my I roommate. 31 yesterday. Happy birthday, dude. Thank Hell you. yeah. Happy birthday. You want me to just write Dr. Funk on here? Or? Uh, yeah, sure. Whatever you want. Uh, you know, it's, gonna, it's just going to, like, sorry. I'm also doing Sergeant one Dr. Funk. Yeah, I can't, do, I can't do periods. Watch what happens if I press a number. It's kind of awesome. It works in the actual game, but like the Ari of Sorrow letters didn't have numbers, so it just does that. It's cool though. I like that. Awesome. Don't fix that. Don't fix that. <laughs> Some bugs are better left unfixed. Exactly. It's a feature, not a bug. Exactly. <laughs> All right. You've seen how this works before. Pick a number. All right. Uh, give me number three. Three is going to be... Easy question. Good start. Yep. Who's the princess of the Mushroom Kingdom? Uh, princess Peach. That's correct. All right. Easy is easy for a reason, folks. Tied for the lead just like that. No, he's not. What? Two points. Uh, Oh, sorry. Look at that. All right. Now, if you get this one, you're tied for the lead, though. Okay. Pick a number. Oh, number right. Uh, number two. Two. (laughs) Dialogue. All right. I'm going to play you a piece of dialogue from a video game. You need to tell me what game the following clip is from. Are you ready? Uh, Sure. You summon and kill. Summon and kill. I fail to see the logic here. Is sanity the price to pay for power? God, I love that scene. Oh, uh, do you need me to replay that again? Turn up the volume, maybe? Because uh, no, because I have got no idea. <laughs> you have no idea at all. Um, Let's take a shot in the dark. No help from the audience, by the way. I should probably state that right now. Uh, d- uh never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing? All right. That was from one of my favorite games, Devil May Cry 4. Yep. Oh, that was our boy Dante I acting out at at an opera scene. Go on over and grab your prize, though. Thanks for playing. Right. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Dawn! Platinum Dawn, the one true Dawn. The key. Oh. I did that on purpose. Relax, guys. I'm upping the volume. (laughs) (laughs) Believe it or not, I've used a computer once in my life. (laughs) Prove it. (laughs) Do I have to take another picture? Oh, wait, but that wasn't maniacal this time. Never mind. (laughs) Hi, time, Pete. Hey, sorry about that. How's it going? It's going great. I've been to like a bunch of your MAGFest panels, but this is the first time I've been picked as a contestant. I nice. just want to say Hell yeah, dude. I, I love your work online, and I've been a follower for a while, and I'm just really excited to be here. Awesome. Well, welcome. What shall I refer to you as? Uh, I go by Spuffles online, so S-P-U-F-F. L-E-Z. Ooh, Z. Ooh. So like that? (laughs) You're more extreme. (laughs) All right. All right. Uh, Well, you've seen how this goes many times, and in this case. Yeah. Uh, Four for the best generation. (laughs) (laughs) Hopefully you I think you just started a fight in the audience. We got. (laughs) All right. Your first question is going to be a screenshot. Tell me what the name of this game oh, is. I need this specific game, not the series. Oh, gosh. Yeah, that would have been too easy, wouldn't it? Yeah, no, I'm not sure what, what game specifically. That's fair. Can you at least give me the series, and then we can work from there? Unfortunately, no. Oh, no, I'm sorry. You want to take any shot in the dark? Um, all I could say is it's not Pokemon. That is correct, but I cannot give you a point for that. <laughs> the, 
These are the main characters of Beautiful Joe, but they are from the anime and the game Red Hot Rumble. Oh, wow. I would Thanks not for playing. Got your prize. Ooh, boy. Should I just, like, end the show right now? Sure, why not? Uh, Get back here. <laughs> we'll do it if we must. Nick, what was your record uh, in, like, was that 2019 or 2020 you set the record? 2019, I believe, with eight. And w it was eight? Yeah. Okay. All right. <sighs> I would like to point out, I don't think anyone has gotten that close. We, I think we've had a six, maybe one yes. seven. Yeah, I think we had a seven. Yeah. I, I remember, was that a set? I thought he had a five. But yeah, I'll, I'll trust you on Wario on that. Yes. Yeah, so, and we, I know we had someone at Apex West do pretty good. But I think that was a non recorded show. Yeah. Uh, but Nick definitely has held the record for the longest. So, how do you want me, you want me to write down Okami or Nick? Uh, you can just put my name as Nick. You know is how it, to spell it, right? Is it NIC or is it NICK? NIK. It is NIK, there we go. Oh, right. damn. I'm just making sure. That name is a landmark. We've, we've known each other for years, which is why we're also giving each other shit, don't worry. <laughs> so how's your day been, John? Uh, it's been miserable. How about yours? <laughs> yeah, marginally better. So, like, if you became a robot, would you just be Robotnik? <laughs> this is why it's miserable. This is why it's miserable. Just give me nine. Let's be done with it. Nine. All right. All right. How are we doing this? What number are you picking? Nine. Nine is going to be... Pick your poison. Ooh. All right. I'm going to give you three challenges here, and you tell me which one you want to do. I don't know why that's in a separate line. That shouldn't have been the case. All right. Uh, your first option is Super Mario Kart for the Super Nintendo. One-on-one -on -one race, 100cc Star Cup, Koopa Beach 1. Your second option is Battletoads for the NES. Turbo Tunnel Death Race, survive the longest. Hmm. It shouldn't be showing this full sentence yet, I just realized. Uh-oh. And uh, the third option is Balloon Fight for the NES. Get the highest score in Balloon Trip in 90 seconds, or when you die, whichever happens first. Which one do you want to do, and who do you want to play against? Myself, Tim, Emil, or a random audience member? Given what people know me for, I've got to go with Battletoads. I'm not surprised. Wow. All right. So who are you playing against? You ever play Battletoads, Emil? Yes. All right. Let's do it. Oh, all right. All right. And while the challenge is being set up, I have to give a big, big thanks to our friend Nintendo Capri Sun. Oh, hi. I'm here. I'm a laptop. Yes, he's the one setting up the challenges today, and uh, he didn't introduce us up at the top of the show, so I wanted to give you that. I just realized we never introduced ourselves, period, actually. Hi, I'm Proton John. <laughs> I'm Nintendo Capri Sun. And I'm Chugga Conroy. <laughs> uh, introduce yourself. Oh, I did already, but I'll do it again. I'm Nintendo Capri Sun. Yeah, it's Here we go. Green is Nick. Orange is Emil. The idea is that they just have to survive the longest. If for some weird reason they end up actually both completing the Turbo Tunnel, A, I'll be Which impressed. Is not gonna happen. And B, uh, whoever has the most life left wins. If it's an exact tie, then then we oh wing my it. God. Oh! First death to Emil. Okay, all right. Still not bad for yeah, first man. life. Yeah. If they get the warp, then that's just the end of the race at that point. Uh, I'll still be impressed. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh. Two deaths to Emil. Two, two lives two. remaining. Zero hearts is still a life, so. And if they live long enough, they can actually earn a one up. Yeah, Emil is, is not going up on those. Final chance for Emil. Point to Nick. Well done. Good bet. All right. Yeet. Come on down, dude. Thanks. In the meantime, I'd like to call up another contestant, if that sounds good by you. Let's do it. 
The next contestant, generated by my magical technology I call a phone, is 370! I was about to say 70. Then you can hear me drumming. Ooh, nice. And now I will regale you with some ASMR. I'm just kidding. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's pick a number, and then if it breaks, then we're going to have to reset the board. Let's go with two. Cool. Come on, let me hear some audio from this. Oh! You know what? Maybe we don't need audio for this. Never mind. I think I, you, you can hear All that right. without the you audio. Don't this not, to this one's to not too bad if you know your gaming history, though. Oh, Por- Lord, no, I don't. Portal is a very beloved series made by Valve, but it's actually based off of a previous game the dev team made in college. What was the name of that game? No Unfor- help from audience. Unfortunately, my Valve info is not up to snuff, so... No guess at all? Uh, yeah, I, I, I don't have anything witty for this. All right, fair enough. The game name was... It was actually just a made-up term, Narbacular Drop. Yeah. It was about a princess, no knees, who yeah. could not jump, so she needed portals to actually get around the world. Nick, grab your prize, and thanks for playing. Woo! Bum, 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 bum. All right, so I'm going to have to reboot the, the, the panel because I'm not getting any audio, and I think that's going to happen every time we switch to a game challenge, oh, which oh. is a problem that I could not have tested. Yes. Yeah. Dang. I love Windows desktops, big fan. All right. Yeah. Wow, look at that. We are going to have to keep resetting questions, unfortunately, which is going to complicate things a bit, but we're otherwise good. How's it going? Good. What's your name? I'm Daniel, but I go by Swazelton online. You're going to have to spell that for me? S W A Z E L T O N. G O what? T O N. Oh. G O T? Swazel got? T O N. I have no monitors, by the way, so I actually can't hear him. Oh. T-O-T-O-N? Yeah. Swazelton? Cool. Thank you. Swazzle. All right. Swazzy. Swazzle. Let's see how the board treats oh. it this time. Pick a number. Let's go five. Five is going to be... Five. 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 <laughs> number Johnny five. <laughs> <laughs> It's not as bad when you guys do it. It's n- not good when he does it right in front of my face. <laughs> All right. Choose your destiny. Ooh. Good start. Ooh. All right, so here's how it's going to work. I'm going to give you five different categories. If for some reason you're willing to pick a Brutal or TRG challenge, I'll give you two points instead of one. But otherwise, you get five options to uh, start your game. Your options are audience challenge, dialogue, screenshot, solo challenge, or lightning round. Let's go solo challenge. Solo game challenge. All righty then. Solo challenge is play Ninja Golf. <laughs> play Atari 7800. Clear the first stage without losing two lives. Come the, on up. The classic that defined a generation. All right. Yo, say what you will. I think this game kicks ass. No, it's good. The next contestant will be number 442. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. Uh, this is your button that does basically everything. Uh, try, I think it's these two that we're going to need. You're going to need jump and attack. Uh, D-pad to move. Uh, as you can see, there's a lot of running around and like fighting gophers and stuff like that. But you also have to actually play golf at the same time, too. So get ready for that. Let's get you set up here. Or did it just crash? That's... <laughs> <laughs> The best QA tester you never paid for. I am genuinely convinced I am cursed. Like, actually. I don't know what I did to deserve it, but apparently it was something really bad. There we go. All right, here we go. Normal. After many long years of ninja training, you are finally ready for the most difficult test of all. Nine holes of ninja golf. (laughs) All right, uh, just, there we go. All right, so you're gonna see a little marker moving up here. That's where your shot's gonna go. Move left and right on the D-pad to aim it. I don't know how well familiar you are with golf, but there you go, you're getting the concept. Now just press the, it's, uh, the button when you're ready to actually do your shot. And now you have to go run, get your ball. 
but you must fight ninjas and gophers. <laughs> you have three lives. I'm only letting you have two for this challenge. You do have a health meter as well. Oh, oh. You also have limited shurikens, right which you are kidney. about to run out of. Oh, God. Out of shurikens. All you can do is kick now. This should be a real life game show. Oh, you're running in the rough. Now you're gonna gotta fight frogs. A frog. <laughs> that, one, that one didn't like you. It's, that one's all right. You ignore him. Yeah. You can pick up more shurikens if you run over there and like duck on the items that, you, that are on the ground, but it might be too late to grab that one in particular. There's also health, there's shields, invincibility. Keep it going. All right, you're almost there. You're almost at your ball. I was about to say, when is the golf? <laughs> All right, you made it to the ball. Now go ahead and uh, try to get towards that flag. <laughs> I'm impressed. Not only is your whole NES library in here, though, but also your 7800? Yo, we, I'm, I'm magic, man. That, that hammer space works real well. All right, that's some health. You might want to pick that up. There you go. Yeah. Ooh. All right, looking good. He's going, he's we going. Might this. He goes, takes out another ninja. Oh, there it is. Jumps over the frog. Takes out a ninja. This game reminds me of Kung Fu. How many frogs are there? Look, this is a very, it, ninja pop, ninja golf's very dangerous, man. You gotta be careful. All right, five extra shurikens. Almost back to your ball. There you go. And there it is. The ball. Now get it to the flag. Now some of you might've been wondering why give him two lives? This doesn't seem that hard. There's a boss fight. For boss time, let's On the go. Green. It's a dragon! <laughs> what? Fight the dragon! The dragon hurts That's a lot. Don't get hit by fire. <laughs> All right, first oh, life no. five down, one to go. Focus on dodging. Fight Don't. that dragon! Fight that dragon! Don't gotta hit it too much. Hit it in the mouth with your shurikens. Couple more hits. Ooh. Just stay alive, just a little longer. Hey! Yeah. Oh, wow. Not bad. Well. Nicely done, that's your challenge. Head on back down to the mic. <laughs> now you know you're calling in life as become a ninja. You can handle the most extreme. Ninja golf kicks ass, man. No, I love it. <laughs> and if the audio doesn't break this time, we'll be monumentally confused. I don't know why. I genuinely don't know why we don't have music. Okay. I'll go um, on. I guess we got DMCA. Let's just hope you don't pick. <laughs> let's just hope you I don't pick a, uh, an audio challenge. Pick a number. Uh, seven. Seven? Seven. Multiple choice question. Ooh. Which of these enemies do not appear in the original Super Mario Brothers game? Boo, Piranha Plant, Buzzy Beetle, or Blooper? Is it C? Is it C, Buzzy Beetle? Is that your final answer? Yeah. Incorrect. Oh. Boo so was not sorry. introduced until Mario 3. Yep. Right. Going over yeah, it's kind of hard to see in your mind's eye, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and then Boo, like, appeared in a remake. Hello, what is your name? Hello, uh, I go by Bar X on, on YouTube. B-A-R-X. B-A-R-X? Yep. Just Barks. Yeah. There you go. Like that? All right, oh, there we go. Barks, barks or Bar X? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Pick us a number. Let's go with eight. So here's the thing. Because we keep resetting the game over and over, you're going to keep getting the same board. That's the actual problem we're running into right now. I can skip ahead a couple boards, but uh, you're probably going to keep seeing Devil Deal over and over here if you keep picking eight. But I'll ask you the question anyways. Do you want to sell your soul? Sure. All right. <laughs> All right, pick us a new number. Everything's worth double points from here on out. Uh, also eight again. Screenshot, which you've already seen this one, so let's go ahead. Oh, I know. <laughs> I hope so. The text is written on screen what the answer is. You're in the way. <laughs> give me a second here. Let's give you a new one. What game's this screenshot for? <laughs> I actually know who. No help from the audience. <laughs> I have no idea. Is it? Oh, hang on. Is it like Quake? Quake? 
Yeah, I don't know. You're actually kind of thinking in a right direction, <laughs> but not the right game. This is uh, actually a horror game. Uh, better known as Silent Hill 2. Oh. Yes! Oh, okay. One of the many Sorry, endings you can get. Go on and grab your prize, get. though. Thanks for playing. Go on and grab your prize. All right, now that we got those splattered remains gone, let's get another contestant. I don't know what it is with me and death today. We'll generate another contestant. They are number 366. <laughs> You're not, we both want to say it. Execute order six. <laughs> Let's see, we got a maroon shirt, There's some short hair, a nice I mint guess. gingham well, mask. Oh, to, to the microphone. Microphone. Yep. Oh, not gingham, sorry, stripes. Yeah. Yep. Hello, how you doing? Uh, surprised. <laughs> <laughs> so are we. <laughs> What's your name? Eric. Eric, E-R-I-C or E-R-I-K? Uh, E-R-I-C. Okay. Uh, oh, that name put thinker. Yeah, so is that, that, that good? Uh, no, for that name, put Thinker. Sorry? Thinker. Thinker? Like the statue. Okay, thank you. I'm just, just to repeat, I, I can barely hear the audience microphone, so I apologize if I had to keep asking over and over. All right. Thinker, pick me a number. Nine. Nine is going to be... Who the heck is that? Now, I think we've already seen this one. Yeah, that was Martin A. All right. Let's get you a new one. She's the more caring of your two parents, but that isn't a high bar when your father expects so much of you as the future ruler of the cosmos. Queen of all cosmos? Queen of all cosmos is correct. Yes! I thought you looked stumped and then he had me surprised. I think it's more so they were surprised that she had a name. <laughs> <laughs> All right, keep going. Six. Six. Screenshot again. <laughs> what game is the following screenshot from? I need the specific game, I do believe. Pikmin 2. Do you want me to accept that or do you want me to fail that? You don't think that counts? It's a specific game, does it say on the text? Hey, what game is the following one? It says what game, yeah. Yeah, all right, I'm sorry I've been told I cannot give you the point because it was actually Pikmin 3. Oh. Uh. oh Thank you for playing, though. Break. Grab your point, uh, grab your prize. Let's get another one. Next oh, up is prize. contestant. Next up is contestant one, zero, three. Yeah. Welcome to the show, come on. Let's see, sock on head, um... Mag shirt. Hi, I'm Ken. I was actually one of the contestants in the live show you guys did in Jersey. Oh, wow! wow. Oh. Thank you for coming to Throne Controllers Live! Yes! Oh, I hope we can start doing those again. I want to do that, too. Uh, you want to be a contestant on our own show? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> the show's awesome, dude, and I never get to play it! <laughs> K-E-N. K-E-N, thank you. Beauty. All right, Ken, let's keep going. Pick a number. Uh, let's go with 10. Number 10 is bad choice. Oh, no! Was yes. this how it played out in New Jersey? Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. All right, well, we already had this one, so we already know about Narvacular Drop. Um, so let's roll you the next one. As of 2021's reported sales, how many copies of Minecraft have been sold worldwide? <laughs> I will give you a number. I'm just looking for a number. You can give me like million, billion, trillion, whatever you think. But uh, I'm going to give you a range of 10, whichever number you pick. Basically. I thought it was in the quadrillions. So give me a number. How many copies do you think as of the end of 2021? 500 million. 500 million is a solid guess. However, it is much less than that, actually. 238 okay. million. Fair. Uh, Fair. Go over and grab your prize, though. Thanks for yep. playing That's again. Still Sorry about that. Another contestant, number 184. Jumping up. Come on down. How you doing, guys? I'm okay. At least one of us is. 
<laughs> How's it going? What's your name? I'm Scott. Scott. Two T's? Yep. Like that? Scotty. Yep. Okay, just making sure. All right, cool. Scott. Welcome to the show. Pick a number. I'm going to go with number five. Five. Just get it out of your system. Just get it out of your system. It's okay. I've done this to all of you. I'm so sorry. It's been three years since I've been able to annoy you to your face, man. I have to hear this in my own streams every night. <laughs> <laughs> it's just normally it's me that has to play the sound file for it. All right. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> so, pick a member of the runaway. <laughs> Chuck it. <laughs> you, don't worry. So, so what? I have a story for this. So I have a story for this. So, uh, Wish, Wish told me, like, yeah, out of the three of you, two of you have, like, horizontal logos, but Emil technically doesn't because you normally use the CC. So he put a placeholder in, and I, and I told myself, like, yeah, I'll fix that, like, when I get everything done. And then when it was 4.30 in the morning and I was finishing the show, I'm like, no, that's staying in there. But anyways, uh, pick a challenge from myself, Nintendo Capri Sun or Chugga Conroy, you may be playing a game against us or you may be playing a solo challenge we made up. Who do you want to pick from? I'm going to have to go with Chugga. I had a oh, feeling. Yeah. All right, what does Comic Sans have for us today? What is Super Chugga? Super Mario oh, Galaxy yeah. 2 oh. for the Wii. Beat the tall nice. trunk slide purple coin star. You get two attempts at this. While this is getting set up, I would like to give a big thank you to MAGFest, who supplied us with mag points for the prizes, some of which have already been given out, but there's plenty more. And also the tech crew who is making this work on Twitch and making it work in general. All right, all right, I think we're back. Um, slight technical issues, unfortunately. Uh, it turns out the Mario Galaxy Challenge is not happening. Our Wii Remote just will not read inputs for some reason. So instead, we will be switching over to a different channel, or challenge. I mean, technically it's channel because of the Wii U, but uh, uh, they're going to be playing Earthbound instead. They must defeat the boss, Frankie, while at level four. Yes. I'm sorry, you're sorry, we're all sorry. <laughs> so you're beating Frank at level four is your challenge. Suffer, Spanky. You're gonna go up to him. You're gonna press L. To P. To P. On him. I'm Frank, and you are. Do you have audio? Come on. Do you have audio from this, by the way? Sorry. Do you have audio? Let's do this. So this is the safe level that speedrunners fight this at. Like him. Um, I used to speedrun Earthbound and level four Frank. Frank says, "Like nasty, your guts went down by one, so you're gonna get critical hits less. 18 damage." You do have some healing abilities. It could be good to keep those in mind. You're already at full health. Gonna bash him again. Frank came out swinging, 18, 13 damage. Yeah, okay. Sorry, attacks. That is the weaker of his two attacks. He has others. You got some burgers. Brandish a knife, 22. Oh, that was good. That was a good You're doing it. Yeah, that was a good move. You, yeah. you predicted him attacking you that turn. You're at full health once again. Going for hypnosis. Oh, shoot. Brandished a knife, 23. Mm. Sorry, tried hypnosis. Did not work. Ooh. Oh. Nice try. Darn hypnosis. And came out swinging. Smash! Oh, no! That's a loss! Oh. It's Sorry. Hard. Thanks for playing, though, dude. Go on and grab that your prize. so depressing. All right, well. At least he wasn't stabbed to death. We'll go with another contestant. We got yeah. number 86. I hope you don't get 86 by your first challenge. Oh, we got, oh, hello, hello. Of all Guess people, hello. Hello. Yes. How you doing, Andrea? Hello, how are you doing, John? <laughs> Is it just like that? Yes. You want to go by that or you want me to write something else down? No, that's perfectly fine. Perfect, all right. Uh, actually, I realized something, hang on. I'm just going to quickly give you a different board. Uh, I mean, you've already heard this one anyway, so we can just yep. fail that one. I'll give you a different board. So there we go. We don't have anyone just pick an eight for the double deal. And hopefully we don't need to uh, reset anymore. 
Here you go, clean board. Let's try it again. How you uh, doing? Let's go number three. Number three. <laughs> Easy question. <laughs> it's like you don't. Well, I mean, you already seen that one, so we'll skip. We'll skip that one. <laughs> Hang on here. So let's. Oh man, yeah. I knew the answer. I think everyone did. What series is Donkey Kong and King K rule from? Are you looking for original game or just general series? I'll take the SNES series. Uh, Donkey Kong Country. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> well done. I got your hesitation. I could like you knew the answer. I could tell, but you're like, which one is he looking for? <laughs> All right. Keep going. Number six. Number six. Oh, I like the multiples of three. Screenshot, you've already seen this one, so let me get you the correct one. We've had two of these already, right? Yeah. yeah. We've had three. Oh, you're right. We have had three. My bad. So you get this one instead. What game is this screenshot from? Oh my God, I, know that. I really liked it. I had to keep it. <laughs> I wish someone would talk to me like that. <laughs> I can guarantee there's at least five people in this chat or in this audience that want to do that right now. And the All chat. Way down. Yeah, there you go. One right there. <laughs> Don't you. <laughs> I wish I'd been filming that. You can do that to me later. Lord, Lord save me. Any idea? I actually have absolutely no idea. <laughs> That's fair. No idea from the characters at all? Nothing? All right. This is... Persona, these are all Persona characters from different games, but this is Persona Q2, New Cinema Labyrinth. This is the one of the 3DS games. Ah, uh, Persona. Thanks for playing, Andrew. Grab your prize. We got one of the early birds who was the first in line. We have a very simple number four. How long did you have to wait in line? I'm curious. Um, maybe like hour and a half, two hour hours. and a half. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, not bad. Wow. All right. Oh, they wouldn't yeah. allow you to line up there until eleven. There was a 11. big like congregation, and oh. then it became like a big line. So. Huh. From glob to single file. Tell yeah. us your name. Um, Juliana. That's J U L I A N N A. Yep. Like that? Mm -hmm. I thought you said Indiana. No. <laughs> wow, well, I heard something right for once. That's a miracle right there. <laughs> All right, Juliana. Welcome. Pick a number. Um, let's do number two. All right, lightning round. I think we've already seen this one. This should be the valve one. Yeah, so we'll skip this. Unfortunately, I gotta. Be do, be do. I forget where the skip. You were good at that. Uh oh. Shoot. Where's the skip work on this one, Wish? Uh. <laughs> no, it's not kicking in. Uh oh. Spoilers. Guess what? You get a free point. <laughs> Uh, Yay! <laughs> I, I, I'm out of the fairness to everyone else, I'm going to have to be like, no, you don't actually get that, but there you go. The, you want to pick another number then? Um, let's do one. All right. You've already seen that. <laughs> like I said, have you ever felt like you're cursed? All right, your actual challenge, Donkey Kong Country Competition Cartridge. All right. I'm going to give you two minutes. You just got to score 1,000 points. All right. Nice and simple. So I think you could just send away for these in Nintendo Power at one point in time. I know, and now they're worth like $2,000. No, ooh, is this the $4,000 one or the $2,000 one? This is the $4,000? Uh, I feel like with game collecting these days, you just assume the higher number because you're probably more right. That's what I hate about it. We did a whole panel about this yesterday. <laughs> All right. All right. She has two minutes to get 1,000 points. Now, the competition card, this I believe was a Blockbuster video exclusive event where um, you just had to play for five minutes and the highest score won like a plaque. I think actually one of our regular viewers has one of these. They've shown oh. it to me before. Oh. Uh, I wish I had done this. Yeah, but uh, basically you get, award you get rewarded for grabbing everything. You get rewarded for bananas, you get rewarded for killing enemies, you get rewarded for finding secrets, oh. one ups. Ooh. You get 50 lives, so dying is not a major issue. However, the timer does not reset. So the best strategy is actually to just go as fast as possible and clear as many stages as you can, because clearing a stage is worth a couple hundred alone. Kong is worth a couple hundred as well, I believe. Serious missed opportunity to not call it a Kong petition. <laughs> Your boos are my life force. You are just feeding me. <laughs> Rambi! 
There's N. Goes to a bonus Se stage. Secrets are worth a bunch of points too. Just run through. Go, just keep go, running. Go, you got go, one go. minute just left. Run. Extra life. Have 50 lives. <laughs> I guess they do account for that. Just keep going. Just keep going. Don't stop if you can help it. Doesn't go for the secret, but goes for the exit worth a lot of points right away. There you go. Oh, wow, just right to the next stage. Stage ending is worth a ton of points. That's already 600 there. 664. Rolling around. Seven, four, misses the K. Get loose. 40 seconds left. Loses uh, the donkey. Uh, Bounces oh, around into the enemies. Oh, okay, nice. Going over the arc, making a rainbow bananas. <laughs> yeah. Diddy is the more agile. Oh, loses him right away. Oh, boy. 25 seconds. Boy. 250 is, points needed. Donkey Kong is pretty terrible in his own game, except Hit the checkpoint. Yes. There okay. we go. So if anything happens, there's at least one last shot. Oh, oh. no. Not enough momentum. You got pie seconds. time to go. Ten seconds. Nine, oh. eight, eight, seven, six, five, 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 five. five, two, five, five. Oh. Nice try. Too much Just stage. Just the end of the stage. I'm curious, curious if you would have gotten it, because you're right at the end of the stage. Here. I yeah, want to see if you actually do get it. Never mind. No, oh, no. <laughs> nice uh. playing, though. Thanks for playing. Nice, nice playing. Can anyone stop contestant number one from being the top winner? Let's find out with contestant number 84. <laughs> Noah, I'm such a big fan. Oh, yes. So, so Look, I'm going to admit. with my woman on your arm. I'm going to admit, if I didn't get it this one, I was going to leave because the Nintendo photo shoot is happening right now. Oh, my oh, God. God. <laughs> How you doing, one of my moderators? Yeah, great. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Nepotism rigged. You want to write Montaro or you want to write something else? Uh, I believe the internet calls me baby girl. <laughs> Is that a G-I-R-L or a G-U-R-L? I don't, I believe both, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm putting the U in there. Yeah. Girl. Yes. That's for my wife. <laughs> All right. All right, baby girl. Pick us a number, pick us a winner. Let's go with nine. Nine? Pick your poison. Nine, nine. Mm -hmm. Super Mario Kart, 1v1 race, 100cc Star Cup, Koopa Beach 1. This is the you, same one. You, you've already done Battletoads, unfortunately. And Balloon Fight NES, get the highest score in Balloon Trip, 90 seconds. So I'm going to have to give you two options, unfortunately, on this one. I'll go with uh, Mario Kart, because that's the only one I know. All right. Who do you want to race against? Myself, Tim, Emil, or a random audience member? Uh, none of you. <laughs> so an audience That's sadly member. not an option. You must pick one of I the four. Yeah, none of you. So an audience member. Audience member, you are racing against the one with ticket 246. Come on down. If you manage to win this, you earn your right to be a contestant. Hi, this is the challenger. What is your name? My name is Jocelyn. Jocelyn. All right, baby girl's picking Luigi. Jocelyn, our audience member, is picking Yoshi. Press Yoshi's the same button twice. so happy. Because you got to lock in your choices. Yes. Don't worry, someone's already done it. Go to Star Cup. The star there you go. Star All right, it does not matter how well we the AI does against you. Help. You just got to beat the other player. Baby girl's on top. <laughs> I stand by that comment. And Jocelyn's on the bottom. Well, you made your bed lie in it. But they're on top, you know. Going through the vegetation. Oh, off of the course. Jocelyn dropping into last. Oh, Wackatoo oh, fishing oh. them out into seventh. Oh, man. We got seventh versus eighth. Jocelyn into the next lap. Getting some coins. We got a banana peel. They're not using their items. Tosses it into the drink. Jocelyn maintaining a good seventh place. Got a red shell. Taking out oh, Mario. Oh, oh, Luigi oh, passes oh. right by. Oh, they're getting the hang They're now gunning for sixth place. It's back. Oh, it's Luigi. Luigi. It's oh, no. Damn, this is. It's baby girl. It's baby intense. girl. Getting further and further ahead as Lagatu slowly fishes out, charging you a surcharge. Man, I hate that surcharge. Luigi into lap four. Baby girl has got a dominant lead. Five. There's five laps. Five. Five. The number will turn red or blue when you get to the last lap. I can't believe I've ruined a fundamental number. There you go. Top That's four. impressive. Top three. 
put that on my resume. You can get it's first like place I was here. saying that like if I founded like you know some kind of like evil organization, I would name it the, so people can't say the word the anymore, and it would mess with everybody. Getting into third place. Baby yes, girl, there he is. Uh, I was really hoping he would use that nice mushroom. Right, go on back down to the mic. They asked me if I knew anybody who could score a point, and I said, I know a guy. Oh, my God. All right. First point for the baby girl. The best part is, it's not even the worst nickname, because I had Joan Mack. What? Jo when I, I misheard Joe and Mac, so I wrote Joe and Mac for one of the polls. Right, yes. <laughs> All right. Next up, let's keep going. Uh, let's ruin the number more. Five. Run it into the green! Hey, on purpose. Uh... Ha! <laughs> well, turnabout is fair play, I feel here. Um... All right, so we've run into a bit of a problem turnabout with the meals challenges. Play. He. Uh, Two of my three don't work, and yeah. we just did one of them. Yeah. Well, we, you have the sensor bar. Why don't you just grab the actual sensor bar with your Wii? We couldn't find it setting up. Okay, I thought you found uh -oh. it. Uh-oh. Where's Kay? Okay. Couldn't find it? No? Yeah, no, we looked All right, everywhere. Then, so from here on out, uh, you earned your Comic Sans title, apparently, because you can't be picked anymore. <laughs> okay, so that means you've got to choose from myself or Tim. How you feeling? I don't trust you. I'll trust him a little bit more. <laughs> this is what happens when you make Spoken everyone... like one of my moderators. Uh, yes. Yes. All right. You pick a Tim? Yeah. All right. Tim, starting you off with Metroid for the NES. Beat Kraid in 60 seconds. He's I have you a... done this before. You've done this before? He's given you a decent amount of items, so you probably got this. Come on up. Yeah, you probably do. Um, John, this is what happens when you make every one of your challenges beat me in a fighting game. <laughs> No one trusts you to not do that. I'm not answering whether or not my first challenge is a fighting game. <laughs> Here Go. he is. He's short. Bombing, bombing, bombing. He's using the right strategy. Oh, using the Getting sneaky strategy. Quite a bit of damage early on. Bomb jumping all over the place. Shooting now. Mm. Gets seconds. some bombs on his head. He loses Ooh. some health from contact. Got yeah. four energy tanks. Yeah, that's You're the pink see, thing. Oh, God. You're probably using the pink thing. You're like in the pink reason. jogging suit. It's just Still got three energy tanks. Little Max Bouncing Samus. all over the place. Yeah. Um, well, that that is half the time. Yeah, half the time. 30 damage. seconds left. Oh, man. Down to three energy oh. tanks. Almost down to two. 20 yeah, seconds left. Three for this. I don't know. I just got done setting the other one of these up literally about an hour ago. <laughs> Ten. Nine. Eight, Eight, seven, seven six, six, five, four, oh three, three, two, one. one. That's no! time. Oh, I'm so close. Oh my god, there, there must have been like. Yeah, yeah, I'm go actually, for it. Yeah, how close were you at this point? Uh, oh, no. Wow, not as close as I thought, I guess. Not really all that close. No, yeah. Dang. There we go. In the mm. drink with you. Sorry, thanks for playing though. Grab your prizes. Dang. All right, we're gonna need a, we're gonna need another one. We're gonna need another one. Who's it gonna be? We got number three fifty three. One of the later ones in the door today. Come on down to the mic. Hey, how's it going? Hello. Hey, what's your name? Uh, I go by Hikaru online. Sorry, I can Hikaru. Hear you. Sorry. Hikaru. Hikaru. Yeah. Hikaru. I know your name. Like that. Perfect. How's it going? Welcome to Throne Controllers. Are you ready? Uh, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead and pick us a number. I'll go with seven. 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 Lucky for some, but for you, not so oh, much. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, and like I said, Chuck us off the board. You got to pick from Nintendo Capri Center myself. I'll go with John. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. Daring. I hate, get real. I hate that I was absolutely called out for putting fighting games in my challenges. Because <laughs> we're playing some Dead or Alive! What? Oops. Ah! <laughs> yeah, that's Dead or Alive, all right. Hey, remember how I said this was a new program I'm not used to yet? <laughs> uh, let's, uh... Hit me. There we go. Don't worry. Don't worry. We put in a failsafe. We, we put in a... I'm an idiot failsafe. 
Uh, yeah. We're gonna play Super Mario Galaxy 2! No, we're playing Dead or Alive 2. Oh. Hey. Okay. Come on up, let's play some Dead or Alive 2. I'd like to preemptively call up another contestant. How's that sound? Yeah. Our next contestant will be number 159! Whoa! I believe you're a first-time contestant, too. I've been to nine shows. This is the first time I've ever been called. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, we'll get to you in a moment for now. So, Kasumi, uh, uh, the old man in the tower, Ayla from Chrono Trigger, Blade. Uh oh. Uh, there's Miss Fushi in the top right. Oh, Miss Fushi. Yeah, Miss Fushi. Um, <laughs> All right, I'll be playing as my so boy Ryu Hayabusa. Final Fantasy VI, Barrett. And they'll be playing as Hayane, or Ayane, rather. All right, so... And they're off. Zero for Mega Man X versus Miss Fushi. <laughs> Miss Fushi's here. She is? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. She's probably not in the audience. I'm like, well, yeah, I thought you meant in the audience. Oh, no. Yeah, John is Hayabusa, our contestant is Ayane, and critical hit, slam down oh into the dirt. Oh my god, that was fast. Round two, fight. You got a sword, why don't you use it? It's like, who brings a sword to a fist fight? The guy who wins. Getting in some combos, already down two, below a quarter, uh, quarter damage already taken. Uh, getting some hits back in. Hayabusa dodging out of the way. He does a counter blow, down below half. Oh, wow. And you are learning why they call him Proton John. <laughs> getting a little bit of damage. Oh, wow. wow, nice. That was cool. That is the Whoa! What was that? I want somebody to do that to me. No! Hayabusa, two points. There we go. Oh, man. <laughs> Okay! <laughs> Go ahead, introduce yourself into the mic so we can preemptively have John forget how to spell it. <laughs> He's not wrong, though. <laughs> uh, my name is Ian. Ian! Do you want me to just write in Ian? <laughs> yeah, whatever you feel, John, it's your show. <laughs> All right, Are you, you cool with that? I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with that if you're cool with it. Make sure I got audio here first. There we go, perfect, all right. All righty then. Ian, you've been here so much at this point, I'm legit glad you actually get to play. Thank you. But I also fear for you because you now have to play. Same. Yeah. <laughs> Pick a number, let's see how it goes. Uh, let's go to number two. Number two for you. Who the heck is that? Oh no. All right, well we've already seen Martinet like Charles five Martinet, times Charles today. Martinet, Charles Martinet! Say Charles Martinet! <laughs> How many have we done at this point? Three? Two? I want to say at least... We'll know when we see it. <laughs> Did you get that? I didn't. <laughs> uh, two. Here's the thing. Two is three. That's why I'm hesitating. I, d I don't blame you. All right. Let's try this one then. Yeah, there we go. A 3D platformer duo that faded into semi-obscurity due to the last game in their series being vehicle-based for some reason. They're facing a resurgence in popularity now thanks to the efforts of some smashing bros. Banjo-Kazooie. Yeah, that's, that's an easy one. Banjo-Kazooie. You can tell when that one was written. That one was written for our last show pre-COVID where they had just oh, gotten added to Smash. <laughs> All right, well, good news for you is if you get one more point, I believe that ties you for the leader. I'm you scared. have two points as your score, right? Yep. So there you go. Oh, boy. Um, oh. Let's go number six. Six is going to be dialogue. All right, is this Devil May Cry again or is this a new one? Let's find out. Let's go to the mailbag. A letter from Mr. Osaki asks, how do I get rid of these nasty roaches? Easy, just burn your house down. All right, uh, do you need that a little louder or? Yes, please. All right. Can you give me a little more volume in the back, please? Let's play that again. Let's go to the mailbag. A letter from Mr. Osaki asks, how do I get rid of these nasty roaches? 
Easy, just burn your house down. I'm gonna take a shot in the dark. What? I'm gonna take a shot in the dark. Uh, take a shot in the dark. GTA San Andreas. GTA San Andreas is incorrect. That is DJ Professor K from Jet Set Radio. <laughs> Thanks for playing, though, Ian. Go and grab your prize. Thank you for thank you for coming. We need another contestant, and they will be number one eighteen. <laughs> Sorry, I knew that. <laughs> Whoa! Hello! Oh, hell yeah, dude. You said Jar Jar Beats! <laughs> oh my god! No, it's Darth Jar Jar. Jar Jar Beats himself in the house! Ooh, yeah. oh, I love it. Oh, we're all such big fans! <laughs> <laughs> George, 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 George. Why has MAGFest got so many celebrities, man? <laughs> Hi, uh, my uh, online name is uh, Lord Gamer Jarzus. Just put Jarzus. J A R S U S. You're not getting Jarzus, you're getting Jar Jar, and you're going to like Jar Jarzus. <laughs> whatever, whatever works. How is it 2023 and no one has just freaking interviewed George Lucas and asked him if the Darth Jar Jar theory is true? I How has that not happened yet? I thought they had. Uh. All right, Jarzus, pick us a number. Uh, let's go with six. Yeah, this track's for Jar Jar Binks. This track's. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Uh, I'm actually gonna say no. You're gonna say no. Oh. oh. I hate to disappoint you, you all. This either means this Jar Jar time. already sold his soul, so I think we've established the dark side theory is in fact correct now. Yeah, I was about to say, this confirms right. fake. For saying no, I'm going to give you a random category. You might still get a brutal question, but uh, let's see what you get. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> let's make it go! You should have sold your soul! All right, you have the pick from myself or Nintendo Capri Sun. Which is the lesser of two evils? I'm a glutton for punishment. Let's go with Proton John! All right. I don't know how I feel about Jar Jar Binks having to debate that for as long as he did. <laughs> All right, uh, me, I'm going to press Mario Galaxy 2 again. Uh, what did I put as my second one? It's probably Bomberman, if I had to guess. Yeah, that's a good guess. <laughs> Super Bomberman oh, 4! Let's play some Bomberman, baby. Come on up. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. What'd you say? He was actually a guy in a suit the whole time. He just asked which character looks like Jar Jar the most. <laughs> All right! Yeah. Go for it. All right. You hit the wrong button. Oh. Oh, I love it when that happens. Ah. You're all lucky this was actually the stage I had to pick. Mathematicians hate him. <laughs> all right, starting off, we have Proton John in the upper left playing as your standard bomber man, and then we have Jar Jar Binks playing as Jar Jar Binks with a jetpack. Let's go, Jar Jar! Oh, bumping him around, combo, he's stunned, he gets out of it! Oh no! Jar Jar has his face melted off! That's one win. So first to two wins. First to two wins, we got some aggression, some close playing, bombs getting kicked around. Oh, oh, going for the kill does way. not like corner it. him quite right. Oh, John being oh, aggressive barely way. dodges oh, boy, it. Boy, John laying down three uh -oh. bombs, trying to set up a chain of reaction, gets a pretty decent uh -oh. one, but not enough to actually get into it. No! We're doing three of five. So we've just given up on PG-13, right, at this point? Or? <laughs> 
There's like a body pillow of Jar Jar Binks in the Yes, shop. there is. I saw that. Got lots of bombs everywhere. Big old chain reaction. Dodge is out of the way. He's out of the way of harm for now. John tossing a bomb. Does not really get any benefit, though. Oh, my Barely God. Oh, oh, no! Tried to Melted hide off his it. toes. The toe. You're never going to believe this. Out of the almost 500 numbers that it could have picked, it picked the very next number sequentially of 119. That's to happen eventually. Oh, what? Again! Again! He's back! Tell a friend. He's back! Uh, hi, I, I go by Slow Beef. Um, I... When, when you were distracted earlier, I went backstage and put a copy of my game, by the way, on stage behind you. I saw you. that. Thank you okay, so much. You're welcome. Yeah, you for did. you. Slowly Thank here you. just launched a game. I did. Yep. It's called Silent Hill 2. You might have seen a screenshot of it. <laughs> no, I, I, did a, I did a stealth horror called Atomets down the indie booth. I don't want to waste your panel time and get some people up here, so I'm ready for you. I want, I want you, John. Let's do this. Thank you. Thank you. Let, let's see how this goes. And thank you again for the copy of the game earlier. Oh, sure. No problem. Yeah. You want me to write you taste some slow beef? You cool with that? Or? Yeah, yeah slow beef's fine. Oops, That's today. good, too. With the E, it's fine. It's fine. Really. Type in my wrong hand. My bad. I, right. I also, I bribed someone for their ticket because I came late. Also, that's a true story. I really did give Tom 20 bucks for this. Give me a four, please. Four? I'm Number desperate. four. Solo video game challenge. You ever play wall guns? Yes. Yeah, come on up. Just All defeat right. the first boss. Woo! All right. Wild guns is awesome if you've never tried it. So is wild arms. Oh, I got a throw boat. Shoot in the head. Shoot in the head. Right in the head. Right in the mouth. We keep opening his mouth for you. Beat him. First down. We have three bombs as well. Run out of the way. Shooting him in the head, getting a few more hits. Getting out of the way, dodges it. Throws a lasso, does nothing. Gets a power up. Gatling ready, dodges it. Nice little easy pattern. Oh! I think. Phase two. Blows up his head. Oh, heads off. He's not coming back after that. Woo! And a mag fest unless Slow Beef gets picked for throw controllers. <laughs> second time up or third time up now? I think it might be my third, but third. I think it's the first game challenge I won, so. I'll pick the one on the right. Oh. You pick, you pick what? No. Pick a number. Uh, six, please. Six is going to be multiple choice question. You, oh, shoot, we've already got this one. I knew it, too, was the thing. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which of these is not a real Pokemon? Mega Pikachu, Pikachu PhD, Pikachu Libre, or Gigantamax Pikachu? Believe it or not, three of those are real. I, I know Gigantamax is, I played it with my daughter. Um, uh, aw, I tried calling her right now. Uh, let me go with uh, A or B. I'll, I'll go with A. You're gonna go with A? Mega Pikachu? Final answer? No, I heard like, a th I'll do final answer. Good choice. Oh, hey. Yep. I, I thought I heard someone go, ah, oh, so it's like, mm, but. That's because right. not everyone in the chat or in the comment. God. <laughs> not everyone in the room. You are it's been three years. I'm sorry. You are not everyone in the room the knows the answer. Give me, uh, give me, is eight safe now? I know Prob there are some. It's my lucky number, so probably not. All right. Eight is going to be lightning round. All right. Category this time around is button count. How many buttons are on these controllers? Oh, now, nice. for reference's sake, because I know there's going to be some arguments, I am counting shoulder buttons and start and select. I am not counting D-pads. But if it has a trigger, I'm counting that as a button. I'm not counting sticks. D-pads or sticks do not count. I'm talking like face buttons, the Xbox button, start, select, shoulder buttons, all that jazz. L3, R3. <laughs> we'll, see if, we'll see if it comes up. We'll see if it, none of them are in there. All right. 
All right. 30 seconds starting now. NES, is there four buttons, yes or no? Yes. Correct. SNES, are there eight buttons, yes or no? Yes. Correct. The Atari Jaguar, are there five buttons? No. So, yep, there's 17 to 22. <laughs> <laughs> the Game Gear, are there six buttons? No. Correct, there are only three. And GameCube, are there seven buttons? Yes. No, there are no, eight. eight. Oh, eight. But snap. you got four, so you win no matter what. That also puts you in the lead, by the way. Are you serious? Yes. You are in the lead. Yes! Thanks, man. You go down your seat. Thank you. Summer of George. Give me a, give me a four. You already picked four. I damn. Never mind then. Um, give me a seven. I was about to say you picked that one too. All right, seven is. Don't even ask. You know who? Yeah, let's do it. Dude, I don't even know anymore. Sanrio World Smash Ball! <laughs> We're hitting all of the yearly traditions here. He just said this is a dream come true for me, John. He's like, to kick my ass, and he goes, I don't know. <laughs> we, we can hope. We, yeah. I don't know, kicking John's ass is fun. <laughs> Metaphorically, right? Okay. All right, we have a Fitbit as the stage. Oh, we got some spinning carousels. Changing oh, the direction. Oh, I like oh. the cards. Got some aggression oh, from yeah, Slow yeah. Beef, who is on top. Oh, there we go. Oh, one yeah, of the nice. shields oh. takes a little bit of damage. <laughs> and gets past it. Knocks out one of John Shields down to one. Oh, just Spin it all around. One of the ball. shields is down. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Slow Beef shields are all at one. Next hit breaks one. Does not do it. Oh, Another man. shield down on Pro Dungeon. John. In oh, goes! Uh, are you seeing this? <laughs> First point Whoa. on the board is Slow Beef. Next round, sir. Round slow two. Beef. It's fan. Power oh. shot! Oh, there we go. Knocks out one of the hits one of the shields for one damage. Gets one of John Shields. They are just in there flailing their arms like in a fake fight scene. Whoa! Powering up. His power shots can be good, but they can also be affected by the carousel. Oh, there. One, one. One and one. One and done. <laughs> John serving his shit to live. Going in there. Uh, 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 uh. Barely slipping past. John power shots and hits two of the shields. One is down. Oh, my God. He's going in. for the kill here. Oh, oh what? 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 Oh, How does that happen? Oh, Oh my god. Oh my god, he put his controller down too early! <laughs> Shield is down to one. Shield's down! Power shot ready! Oh! Oh! Match points! It's down to the last round, I can't believe this. Lost for words. Look at you now! Look at you now! Do nothing! Wow. Can I get security, please? Okay, like. So Don't like, actually get security, all right. <laughs> like, okay, this, this makes a lot of sense. Like, us fighting you and when you created Let's Playing is like normal people trying to kill God. <laughs> I mean, basically. I don't think his ego needed that big of a stroke, but thank you. <laughs> Say that and I just blew up my voice pretty bad. Um, let me get number 10. Number 10? All right. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Whoa. All right. I know it's not Silent Hill 2. <laughs> Halo. Halo is correct. Yeah. That's our first mug of the day. <laughs> Give me number one. Choose your destiny. Okay. This could get interesting. All right. Uh, same deal, if, you, if a brutal question or TRG challenge comes up, if you pick it, it's worth two points, but otherwise you can pick whatever you want out of these five. You get, pick your poison, solo challenge, easy question again, audio question, or lightning round. 
Uh, I'll take lightning round again. Lightning round? The category this time around is PlayStation All-Stars. Oh, God. Were these wow. characters playable in PlayStation All-Stars yes. on PS3? <laughs> that is correct. You win. <clears throat> All right, let's begin. Isaac Clarke, playable or not? No. Yes. Zeus, playable or not? Yes. Yes. Old Snake, playable or not? No. Correct. Evil Cole McGrath, yes. playable or not? Yes. Oh. Cat, playable or not? No. Yes, yeah, she's from Gravity Rush. But you got three, so. Wow. What? This game? I guess not, all right. <laughs> what happened? Oh my god, did I roll it over? You did too good! <laughs> I knew I'd break your paddle! <laughs> this game had, the game had a weird roster. So many like of the big characters that would have been in it were stolen by Smash Brothers. Alright, so your score was like what, six? Let's let's just yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Again. <laughs> Slow beef vaga. I thought that said something like else. A new spell in Final Fantasy. Give me a give me a four. Alright. <laughs> what do I pick? It's a day. I would like to reiterate for the third time, I'm pretty sure I'm cursed. Screenshot, dialogue, TRG challenge, easy question or multiple choice question. Challenge. All right, sure. I'll you're, take You're challenge. doing TRG challenge? Yeah. What's the easiest for you to do technically? Anything but, but we can do it no matter what. We can do them all. TRG challenge again? Yeah. Uh, how many challenges did I have? Have I been picked three times? Yes. So yes. You only have Tim to pick from. So. That's great. No, I, I I did what I came here to do, so I'm. That's right. that's can... fair. <laughs> yeah. I it will take days for me to recover from this. <laughs> Minimum. All right. Well, Tim's challenge is Zelda 2: The Adventures of Link. Beat Thunderbird in 60 seconds. Also, the levels are attack six. For those who can't see, Slobby is currently wearing a Zelda 1 shirt, so I have confidence in him on this one. Thunderbird, the second to last boss of Zelda 2, is notoriously difficult and at the end of a long dungeon. Already taking in a little bit of damage, down one segment. Swatting in the air, gets it a little bit more. You can see the boss's health on the left there. Forgot this was Down two time. segments. The boss definitely has the upper hand right now. Taking a life spell. You do have you have a time limit on this. I should point out. So no magic. Thirty-five seconds. Forty seconds. Just saying, got his thunder. He's already done that. No, he's good. He knows what he's doing. You can tell. He's got shield on. He's already used thunder. He's doing great. But he does have thirty seconds to finish this boss off. Barely dodges those hits. Survives through another round. Yes. 20 this seconds remain. Get in some more hits. Hang it on by a throw. Fair enough, that's enough time. But let's be real, you did incredible. So, Reign of terror. <laughs> What's this part? Oh, like you, you won. So like you gotta, you gotta take the prizes. Yes. yes. Yeah. yeah, that part. Yeah, yeah. So, all right. So, so yeah, your reign of terror went, went so big that it took up the remainder of the time that we had. So, yours is a mega yarn Yoshi. Right. And a complete da -da -da. copy of Pokemon Heart Gold. Right. Now, before we go, before we go, uh, we do have one big final announcement we, we have to do. Um, oh, you can yeah. go grab the rest of the prize if you want to be, but thank you so much for playing, and thank you for thank winning. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I really appreciate So one thing we haven't done yet this year is announce the dates for the Runaway Guys Coliseum 2023. Uh, that is because we realized we were so far behind on things. However, we figured a good time to show it off would be here. So it's for three days of Easy Gaming Fun, raising money for direct relief. Remember guys, Coliseum oh, 2023! Yeah. March 3rd to 5th! 2023! 12 plus hours daily! 
we will be in person, all of us. All of us. Thank you for coming, everybody, MacFest. You are wonderful. See you next year. See you next time. Nut pickle.